The first 170,000 doses of vaccine are expected to arrive in New York within a week, and they would be going first to nursing homes and health care workers. And here in western New York, two on your side's Jeff Preval shows us an effort already underway to convince people the vaccine is safe. Well, the state's COVID-19 vaccine distribution and implementation task force is made up of a lot of health officials across the state, but there's also a Buffalo based reverend who serves on it, and she says that it's her goal to correct a lot of the misinformation out there about the vaccine. Reverend Diane Hold of AME Zion Church, located on Buffalo's east side, spoke to us today in a virtual interview. She says that she senses a lot of misinformation out there in the community about the vaccine that's spreading by word of mouth. Reverend Hold says that it will be her job to communicate with people about the facts of the vaccine to people of different nationalities and ethnicities. Reverend Hold realizes that there will be many months of separating facts from misinformation. Now, as far as my work, it will be making sure that the information, research-based information, any type of videos that um, can be proven to be scientific and are correct because there's too much mis information in terms of the actual rollout of the first batch of Pfizer vaccines. It's 170,000 doses within the next week, then more later this month. We're still not exactly sure how many Western New York will actually get and the state health department for security reasons is not saying where COVID vaccines will be stored. Erie County has said that it has identified cold storage locations to store the vaccine. Now, the county has also said that it has identified mass vaccination centers, but those won't be used for months. Reverend Holt says that when vaccines are open up to the general public, simplicity and accessibility will be key. In Buffalo, I'm Jeff Perval, Channel 2 News.